Hello, this is David at the Lebed and Gun Shop. This video shows what we do to make a custom muzzle brake for your rifle. We start with a stainless steel spiral port blank like this one. We begin by setting the barrel up in our specially designed gunsmith lathe. First we indicate off the outside diameter of the barrel, then do a final alignment off the bore to less than one thousandths of an inch run out. Once the barrel is running true, we start with turning down the barrel in order to cut the threads. We single point cut all our threads. This is the only way to ensure the barrel is cut true with the bore line. We never use a tap and die. Achieving a precise major diameter and a square shoulder is imperative for a muzzle brake that will not only look good but will not impede the accuracy of the rifle. Special care is paid attention to not damage the crown of the barrel. You may notice the brass cone that is being used to protect the crown while the live center holds it in place. This is an example of the care we provide to your barrel while we're working on it. The lathe is equipped with a digital readout and a variety of both digital and analog measuring instruments are used. Carbide insert tools are used for all the cuts. Once the correct diameter is achieved, the shoulder is squared. We take an extra step in this process and use a special cutting tool to ensure we get a good square shoulder in place. Next, the edge is chamfered and smoothed so the brake will easily start onto the threads. Now we're ready to start the threading process. For this brake, we're going to use 24 threads per inch. A scratch cut is performed and checked with the thread gauge. This is performed to ensure the threads per inch are correct. The single point thread cutting process begins. The brake is checked periodically to ensure a snug fit. Finally, the chamfer is cut, the threads are hand filed and brushed smooth to a final finish. Then the inside diameter is cut to match the bullet outside diameter to 20 thousandths of an inch. The final step is to sand the muzzle brake in various grit paper to match the finish of the barrel. And that's how we make a custom muzzle brake. 